Trolls. What they good for? Absolutely nothing. Say it again. We're in the mundane. Be right back. So my buddy Dane, uh, who runs a great channel, it is called uh, Celine Driver. He did an episode a little while back where he went on a rant about a bunch of things. One of the things he was talking about was trolls. And so it got me thinking a little bit and I kind of wanted to uh, kind of just respond to his take on that and maybe just uh, have a little fun with the conversation. So again, uh, I will link the description down below. Uh, Dane's channel is Celine Driver. He uh, does watch reviews. Obviously, he does rants. Um, he likes football, so he does talk about football, too, as well. Kind of teasing him with the Alabama hat today a little bit. But it got me thinking about trolls. You know, I I've been in this hobby for about 18 months or so, and one of the things I've noticed is that um, they exist. They are um, disrespectful, they uh, keep you away from certain channels or keep you away from certain Facebook groups and stuff. Uh, it's just, I guess, it's a nece necessary evil in any hobby you're in. Uh, I personally don't really understand it, especially in today's day and age, that very simply, if you don't like something that you're watching, uh, click on buy. There's there's other stuff. I, I think a lot of times folks are just trying to get attention. Um, I, I like I said, I, I really don't get it. And I have been very blessed so far on my modest channel. Um, they they haven't come out to me yet. Maybe this will change things a little bit. To to some degree, I almost would think it as a badge of honor to start to start getting a few. Um, I've actually had very few thumbs downs. You guys are super polite, and I, and I appreciate that. Um, but like I said, one of the well, one of the mantras on my channel is staying positive. So the whole concept of trolling and stuff just doesn't make sense to me. Uh, I think from this is kind of my personal take. I started to read some psychology articles on trolling. I was going to kind of uh, put some of that stuff into this. But but really, for the most part, I, I kind of wanted to talk about, for me, the, the whole negativity aspect of somebody that goes out there and just tries to pick a fight with everybody. Now, that's, that, now that's different than going out and... You know, having lively discussions with folks, and, and and sometimes there's a fine line, and maybe sometimes it's hard to differentiate. Uh, I, I think that's where you kind of need to know your audience a little bit. You need to get comfortable talking with folks, and then you know, kind of move the discussion a little bit. But I think you can have disagreements with somebody without trolling them. Um, I, I think it's a it's a life skill, so to speak, or maybe just a way to. You know an easier way to kind of deal with people uh, I don't know I, I'm having a hard time developing that particular thought um, but one thing I, I would like to put out there is you don't have to take something back that you didn't say you know so if you don't say it you don't need to take it back I on several occasions have typed even with some 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 guys I'm pretty close with I've typed something and then before I hit the send button I was like yeah don't think I'll hit send on that and, and I, I think I'm close enough with some folks that you know they can put me in back in check or you know they they give a little forgiveness but at the same token you have to have a modicum of common sense you know uh, it makes me think of makes me think of my uh, my buddy Dirk just did a just did a, a video on packaging and stuff which is just common sense and, and I think, and I think, instead of me just continuing on to ramble about this, um, I, I think just having the common sense aspect too as well, and, and why why bring negativity into somebody else who's trying to create something or putting themselves out there to, for everybody to see? Uh, like I said, I, I, I don't get it. So. Uh, 
but at the same token, um, it, it just Dane really got me thinking, and so I just wanted to kind of just go on my, one of my little uh, rambles. Um, I'm trying not to rant, but maybe I'll start calling these uh, my rambles, and uh, my dog, I think, is signifying that uh, I've gone long enough now. Uh, but again, if you like this, please like and subscribe down below, and I will link one of Dane's rants videos down below too as well and if you do not subscribe to his channel you are definitely missing out especially if you like uh, Zelos um, go back in his archive um, the man's got an incredible number of them but anyway guys stay positive make friends enjoy the journey and I will catch you next time bye bye